What's up, guys? So, if you've been following the Idaho 4 case with Brian Kohlberger, uh, this was stuff taken out of his house that could have been blood, but they weren't 1,000% sure it was blood. And there was two things that uh, were positive for blood. Uh, a reddish brown stain on in encased pillow. So it's positive for blood. And then there was a second one here. Uh, mattress cover on bed in uh, near room on edge facing doorway brown and regular drip which was also uh, positive for blood so so there was two items out of his house that were positive for blood and then there was and I didn't save it I don't know why the hell I didn't save it but there's four pages and one of the pages there was an item that uh, they couldn't prove any if it was uh, had blood or not. If the it was positive for blood or not, there was a, one item that was like that. So there's at least two items of blood that could be his own blood because it was in his apartment, but it also could be the Idaho Four students. Like we're just gonna have to wait until trial comes to see what all happens. But what do you guys think? Comment below. And let me know.